Dead at 86, legendary actor from The Young and the Restless and Days of Our Lives. Saying goodbye is a difficult task. We had hoped that the worst of 2022 was behind us, but it appears that fate still had one more devastating surprise in store for us. It turns out that Quinn Redeker passed suddenly on December 20, 2022, as reported by our sister site Variety. 86 years of age was a significant milestone for him. Many viewers recognized him from his performances as Alex Marshall on Days of Our Lives and Rex Sterling on The Young and the Restless. What some people might not know is that he was also a writer. He collaborated on the script for the critically acclaimed 1978 film The Deer Hunter, which starred Robert De Niro, Meryl Streep, and Christopher Walken, among others. In recognition of his work, he was nominated for an Academy Award for Best Original Screenplay. However, Redeker's acting is probably what he is best remembered for. Before settling into daytime in the late 70s, he was a frequent guest performer on shows like Barnaby Jones and Starsky and Hutch. He was also no stranger to the big screen, having appeared in films as diverse as Airport and The Andromeda Strain. Fans of The Young and the Restless will always remember him as Rex Sterling slash Brian Romilotti, perhaps Catherine's greatest love and the father of Danny and Gina, but that wasn't his first time in Geno City. Redeker made a brief appearance as Nick Reed in a few episodes in 1979, a full decade before his Rex debut in 1987. Nikki killed her abusive father when she was protecting herself from a rape attempt. While Rex could be a scoundrel, he was nothing compared to her father. Between his roles as Nick and Rex on Nick and Nora, Redeker appeared on Days of Our Lives as Alex Marshall in Salem. While Nick Fallon's grandpa certainly wasn't a monster, he had no qualms about breaking the law while doing things like working for Victor Kyriakis and conducting a heroin ring with Stefano de Mera. We last saw him in 1987, when he was being taken to prison for arson, having burned down the Salem Inn, which he owned at the time, in order to cash in on the insurance. As Rex, Redeker made incalculable contributions to daytime television and was twice nominated for a daytime Emmy. Our hearts break at the loss of yet another acting legend, and our condolences go out to Redeker's loved ones. Losing loved ones is never easy, but it can be especially difficult over the holidays.